Now, along with the Unity Basic tutorial, we will also start a new video series, which is basic tutorial for first person shooter game, or it's popularly known as FPS. For this, we will create a new project and then select the name of the project as FPS. In the very first video of this series, we will learn how to move our camera inside the game with the help of the mouse. So without any further explanation, let's just jump into it. At first, go to the hierarchy and hit right click. Then go to 3D object and select capsule. I choose capsule because it's somehow like a human body. Also create a plane in which our player can stand on. Rename the capsule as player. And resize the capsule if you wish. Add a rigid body component to our player by go to the add component section inside the inspector tab. Go to the constraints inside the rigid body and freeze the rotation on every axis. Move the main camera onto our player. And also move its position to our player set position. Go inside the inspector tab of the main camera and add a new script. Which we called camera movement. Then hit double click on that and it will pop up in the visual studio. For make your code more clean, delete the first two using text. Now just before the start function, take two float variables, rotation on X and mouse sensitivity. and set the mouse sensitivity to 90. And also take a public transform and we call it player. Now inside the update method, take a float mouse y and take its value from the mouse movement. To do that, Write input dot get axis, then open and close parenthesis. Inside the parenthesis, write mouse y. Mouse y is the predefined value which is stored inside the Unity editor. And it take the horizontal movement of the mouse as an input. Then also multiply it with time dot delta time. And also with mouse sensitivity. Now copy and paste this line again and change the y's with x. Take the rotation on x equals to rotation on x minus mouse y or you can write it as rotation on x minus equal to mouse y. We can clamp our vertical rotation so that our player couldn't look up or down more than 90 degree. To do that, we will write rotation on x equals to mathf.clamp and inside bracket we will write rotation on x comma minus 90f on y and 90f on z. The next line we write transform dot local Euler angles equals new vector 3 and in the bracket write rotation on x on x, 0 on y and also 0 on the z. The local Euler angles is relative to the player's transform rotation. Then set the player rotation on the next line by writing player dot rotate 
and inside the parenthesis we take vector 3 dot up and multiplied it with mouse x if we want our cursor to be invisible when the game runs then go to the start function and write cursor dot visible equals to false and cursor dot lock state equals to cursor lock mode dot locked this will also lock our cursor when we start the game now hit control and s to save the script then go back to unity editor and add our player to the player component inside the camera movement script hit play and you will find our camera is moved perfectly that's it for this video in the next video we will add a movement script to our fps character thanks for watching